Hi friends, welcome to Interactive Medicine. In this section, we can talk about the blood-brain barrier and blood CSF barrier. What is the main difference between these two barriers? We know the entire blood which circulating in our body is does not enter into the central nervous system. So I am talking about what is the actual the blockade, the actual what happens, the actual barrier where present in the blood brain barrier and the blood csf barrier blood brain barrier means when the entire blood where which circulating in our bodies cannot enter into the central nervous system but some contents can enter into the uh, brain and the spinal cord we can go into a picture here here is our central nervous system here is our circulating blood and its vessel and the vessel is get into the central nervous system what is the actual blockade here so uh, a doctor uh, who experimented in a cat he injected the even blue dye into the cat and he noticed that the dye is uh, get into all organs of this cat but except for central nervous system and he thought that there is a barrier mechanism between the central nervous system and the blood so the future studies contribute that in blood brain barrier there is a specialized endothelial cells which have the tight junction tight junction which does not allow the entire blood into the central nervous system and this filtered fluid is known as extracellular fluid extracellular fluid which give the nourishment to the neurons and the micro uh, microglial cells we, we know astrocytes there are so many glial cells which support the neurons the nourishment for these neurons and the glial cells is done by extracellular fluid when we uh, come to what is the barrier at uh, blood CSF barrier this is our microcirculature and we have the basement membrane here is the glial cells the ventricle is lined by ependymal cells and which have some specialized ependymal cells known as choroid epithelial cells which have which have the tight junction which does not allow the entire blood get into the ventricle so the cerebrospinal fluid is formed and you should understand here to concept that in blood brain barrier the barrier at specialized the endothelial cell which have the tight junction and blood csf barrier which have choroid epithelial cells which have the tight junction and you should understand that there is no effective barrier between the cerebrospinal fluid and the extracellular fluid which uh, which can come into ventricle and goes out so the content of the extracellular fluid and the cerebrospinal fluid is approximately same okay and here is our, we can talk here the blood brain barrier the barrier at endothelium in blood csf barrier barrier at choroid epithelial cell both have tight junction and the filtered fluid is extracellular fluid in blood brain barrier and filtered fluid is cerebrospinal fluid in blood csf barrier and there is no barrier between extracellular fluid and CSF which means they can easily move from ventricle and move back and next concept we should understand that here is our central nervous system and we uh, we have the pyometer here this is small lining we should understand that it's a uh, delicate very thin so it is not act as a effective barrier so we have the cerebrospinal fluid in the sub arachnoid space here is our arachnoid matter and what this space 
sub arachnoid space okay this uh, sub arachnoid space have cerebrospinal fluid which can easily enter into the brain and extracellular and extracellular fluid can enter into sub arachnoid space too uh, for us i remember what what is this this is uh, lateral ventricle this is third ventricle cerebral aqueduct fourth ventricle and the central canal okay this is our cerebellum and this is pons and medulla okay then uh, we know in adult person the bilirubin can't enter into the central nervous system but we should understand that in child the blood brain barrier is more permeable than adult in newborn baby blood brain barrier more permeable than adult it is not full developed in infant so infant born with severe jaundice and because of the the bilirubin enter into the central nervous system the bilirubin unconjugated in the blood and it affects the cerebral cortex and the basal ganglia and cause the mental retardation and the motor po problems and this effect is this condition is known as kernicterus or other causes like rapidly growing tumor in brain with break blood brain barrier or undeveloped blood brain barrier which means that we know uh, cancer is uncontrolled proliferation of cells so it is multiplying very fast and these cells are not going to mature so it does no it does uh, there is no time for uh, developing fully developed blood brain barrier this break the blood brain barrier uh, will allow the blood contents into the brain it will affects the our neurons and the glial cells and specific brain areas etc and other causes inflammation or infection we know during inflammation or infection um, our body will release some chemical mediators which can shrink the endothelial cell so there be a gap in the endothelial cells so the blood can enter into the brain and we can say some benefit there because many antibiotics can't enter into central nervous system because of blood brain barrier physiologically but if a bacteria disrupts blood brain barrier and enter into central nervous system then antibiotics can also enter into central nervous system through this broken blood brain barrier and kill the bacteria so the concept we already thought that there is no barrier between extracellular uh, sorry cerebrospinal fluid and pia matter is not act as a effective barrier ependymal cells are not a barrier effectively there is no privacy between cerebrospinal fluid and extracellular fluid they can intermingle at any time and finally the uh, the scientists uh use the dye for uh the for finding the mechanism of blood brain barrier is evan blue or triptan uh that dye we you know it conjugated with the protein so it does not enter into the central nervous system through this barrier okay friends i think this video is helpful for you and if you have any suggestion you can comment in the box if you like the video please make a thumbs up and share to your friends thank you have a nice day